Welcome to another episode of Contemporary Living with Farmer Hill. I am one of your hosts, Andre Hill, and to my right and to your left, perhaps, is my lovely wife, Melissa here. Hey, beautiful. I see you. All right, so we're going to do something different tonight. Uh, me and my wife, we always go to the movies. Yes. And every time we post on Facebook, everybody wants us to get it on some reviews. So today we decided we're going to do something different, and we're going to get some reviews today on some movies that's out. And we're going to show you how to save some money. And then I think we're just going to have a good time for the next maybe five or ten minutes. Yeah, so we don't know how this conversation is going to flow. So there might be spoiler alerts. So let's just do that right now. There may be spoiler alerts. We may give the movie away. So if you want to see this movie, be careful. All right. <laughs> she get a movie away. It's her fault. All right, so here we go. We're going to jump right into it. Uh, so first of all, let's talk about some discounts out there. How to save some money. So number one is $5 Tuesdays. That's the best time. That's the best time to go to the movies on yeah. Tuesdays. $5 Tuesdays. A lot of locations nationwide to give you free popcorn if you go on Tuesdays. Yep. Um, also, one thing we like to do is ask for military discounts. My wife served 20 plus years in the Army. And so we always ask for the military discount. Yeah. That's if we go like late in the evening because if doing the matinees, you're not going to get a discount. Yeah. Also, you can become a rewards member. Um, as a rewards member, you can also get um, free tickets. If you like us, you go to the movies all the time. Mm -hmm. So the rewards are pretty good. Um, if they give us a free ticket, we kind of like to use that and we go to like a late show like on a Saturday or Sunday. Yeah. We don't want to use it for $5 Tuesdays. Yep. And then you want to look at Groupon. Yep, Tiffany Haddish told y'all about that Groupon. Yeah, yeah, so don't, don't forget you got Groupon. So you can always go to Groupon. They always run in specials and deals on tickets. A lot of times they got like two tickets for like $15, save you about $5. And if you're part of a real estate association, real estate associations like ours um, that we're with, uh, Realty One Group, also give discounts on movie tickets mm -hmm. as well. I think you save about... Maybe a dollar twenty five cent, a dollar twenty five cents, something like yeah, that. Yeah, and then you know it might not just be we belong to a real estate association, but it could be association, maybe a professional organization or association that you belong to. They may have discounts as well. Absolutely, and then last but not least, I ironically just got this email right as we was preparing for this show. Um, Restaurants.com, Restaurants.com, as you can see to the screen to the far left, they have a special going on for thirty dollars. You get two movie tickets and you get a hundred dollar Restaurant.com gift card. So you can save some money as well. So we like Restaurant.com as mm -hmm. well. So if you're looking to save some money, you're looking for a bang for your buck. These are some ways that you can um, save money. So we're not going to prolong the time. So the first movie we're going to get into today is called Vice. Starting Christian Bell, playing uh, Vice President Dick Cheney. We also have Sam Rockwell playing George W. Bush. And then we have, what's the name, Steve? Steve Carell. Steve Carell mm -hmm. as well. And he's playing Donald Rumsfeld. The 40 year old virgin. Yeah. So what we're going to do, we're going to check out this preview. I don't and, think then, he's a virgin anymore. and then we're going to come back and then we're going to give you what we thought about the movie. Stay tuned. I'm going to load it up here for you guys, and we'll be back in about two minutes. What do you say? I want, I want you to be my MVP. MVP. I, want I want you. You're my boss. Well, George, I, uh, <laughs> I'm the CEO of the market. And I have been Secretary, Secretary of Defense. Defense. And I am in White House, Chief of Staff, Vice Presidency is a most small job. Uh, however, if we came to a uh, different understanding, I can handle the work one day. Jobs, overseeing, bureaucracy, military, energy, and uh, foreign policy. Right. I like that. When you have power, people will always try to take it from you always. I 
more ruthless than I used to be. I believe we can make this work. <laughs> Hot Hot damn. Damn. All right. So there you have it, Melissa. What you think about the movie? You know what? You should definitely watch this movie. And mm -hmm. the reason I say you should watch this movie because it, it it takes something complex and it turns it into something comical. It turns it into a storyline. Yes. It's got a little bit of fantasy in it, but you get to learn about our vice president, former vice president, uh, Dick Cheney, and yes. just some things that that whoever the director was imagined that happened, and some they took some real facts and then they added you know some fantasy to it and it it made for a really good movie very entertaining especially if you're into politics and you follow to follow politics this is definitely a must watch what yeah. did you think yeah i think it's an excellent movie um definitely i recommend that people go see it it takes you into the life of um, former vice president dick cheney um, if you if you watch the movie, you'll start, find out that he was considered like he was a drunk, pretty much a nobody. Um, but his wife, you know, she really influenced him. And it reminds me of Napoleon Hill when he talked about when he studied most successful men. It was always their wife that helped them um, become great people. So one thing I do like did like about the movie is that when you learn about former Vice President Dick Cheney, he was a very patient man. He, he was very, very patient calculated. and calculated. Yeah. And they was ruthless. I'm just be honest with you. Him, Donald <laughs> Rumsfeld, they, 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 they was ruthless. Man, he had a plan. You yeah. talking about a man with a vision? Yeah, he had a plan. And we, actually, oh. we see the effects you know the effects of his plan today. Yes, we are today. still living those. We, st we are. Yes, we are. Um, when you when you think about the war that's still going on in Iraq and Afghanistan, um, Dick Cheney and, them and George Bush really set that tone. Yeah. Now, as far as the acting, um, Christian Bale, I think he just won the Golden Glove for this movie uh, for the um, best actor in a comedy slash drama. Hey, he did his thing. A dramedy. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Christian Bale. I'm really not a big Christian Bale fan, but he did his thing. Mm -hmm. And um, Sam Rockwell. Sam Rockwell. I think he's, he's one beast. of the he's one of the most underrated actors. Yes. In Hollywood today. Yes. Yeah, yeah. so he was George. He played George Bush. Yes, absolutely. Yeah. So he did an excellent job. Yeah. So he did a great job. We love the movie. We recommend that you go see it. And like Melissa said, you don't have to be a be a fan of George Bush or. Or, or Dick Cheney, I don't care if you're a Democrat, a Republican, Independent, whatever you want to label yourself, this is a great movie and definitely a must-see, and it's, it's a movie that you must have in your household when it comes out on DVD as well. Yep. So uh, <laughs> we'd like to hear what you think. Please comment below. Follow us on YouTube at Contemporary Living with Farm and Hill. If you're in Chicago, you can catch our show in the Chicago South Suburbs. You can catch our television show tonight, Contemporary Living with Farm and Hill, at 9 p.m. Central Standard Time on Comcast Channel 19. Yep. And you also can follow us on Facebook at Farm and Hill, Contemporary Living with Farm and Hill. Or you can just shoot us an email at farmandhill at gmail.com. <laughs> that's a whole lot of farm yep, and hill. Yep, yep, so just yeah, find us. You know where to find us. Yep, just find us. <laughs> so, as always, we thank you. Have a blessed night. And wait for our next movie review, which we, we will be doing, The Mule. Watch it or wave it. That's what we calling it. Yes, watch it or wave it. I say watch it. I say watch it too. She says watch it as well. So, this is a must-see. Stay tuned for our next video as we look into The Mule, starring the one and only Clint Eastwood. Be blessed.